back to Arc Tutorials. This is JavaScript Top 100 Coding Interview Questions and Answers. In the last episode, question number 3, we saw how we can find the duplicate elements in an array. The next logical question that comes after that is, how do you find the count of duplicates in an array? This is one of those use cases that you would find yourself using on a day-to-day -day basis as well. You'll get a array and you want to find out how many duplicates are there and what is the count of them. Let's find out in this particular episode that is question number four, how to find the duplicates in an array. But before I start coding, I'll request you to get my ebook on JavaScript which covers this popular top 100 coding snippets that would help you become better developer as well as help you crack the front-end developer interview. Check out the book at arctutorials.gumroad.com. Thank you in advance. All right, so today's question is, how do you find the count of duplicates in an array? Now this question can be really tricky because this can be solved in multiple different ways. There is no one standard way of doing it, but I'm going to show you the most optimized solution for it. We will make use of array reduce method using which we will create an object, initialize it to empty and then push the object key. And if the key is present using, uh, we'll check if the object key is present then we will assign increment that key or else we'll fix the value to one. That's the high level logic of how you go about solving this particular problem. Now let me show that in code hands on. All right, so I will start from basic thing that is script and I'll create a array, let's say months and I'm going to duplicate some values. Let's say May, Feb, and Feb. This is most likely that you would use this snippet in mostly in your applications every now and then. So now let's duplicate May, duplicate Feb, July, and December. All right, so here we have an array which has some duplicate values. Now we want to find out the count of the duplicates. So I'm going to again count of duplicates is equal to. So now we are going to make use of array dot. These are the built-in methods that of array and I'm going to make use of reduce method. So if you see here, it uses previous value current index with the initialization. All right, so we are going to need two things here. First, the object that we will create and initialize and next the value of it. Now here we'll initialize the value and make it empty for first. Then we'll just need a if statement and say if object of month, that means if the key is equal to equal to undefined, then what you should do is you should set the value of month to one because the count is one if it is undefined and return this object. Else, if it is duplicate value, then all we will do is we will just increment that key value and return the object. That's it. This is the most optimized solution to find the count of the duplicates in a particular given array. Now let's do a console log to check if our logic is correct. All right, now let's go back to browser and reload. And now there we see the count is for February the count is 3 May is repeated twice and remaining are 1 right so that's the most optimized way to find the count of duplicate elements in a particular given array I hope it's clear I hope you try it out and let me know if you have any questions or if you run into any issues all these snippets and much more are covered in my ebook so make sure that you go to the website arctutorials.gumroad.com and get your ebook today to master JavaScript coding snippets that are often asked. Thank you so much for joining. See you in the next episode.